Hello ladies and gentlemen, it is me Ubuntu Helkai and in this video I'm gonna show you a few more features you can do in uh, CCSM. So uh, if you haven't watched the first video I'll post an annotation in the top right corner for a few seconds and you can go ahead and watch the video. But anyway, let's uh, go ahead and uh, begin this video. So um, the first thing, I wanna show you four things in uh, this video. The first thing is uh, this OpenGL thing. Now uh, when you install Ubuntu and you install CCSM for the first time, uh, you will see this OpenGL. So if you go ahead and open that, and right here it says sync to vblank. Now it is uh, checked by default, but um, you know if your, if your uh, graphics card is a bit older, you uh, might want to disable this because uh, otherwise you will probably get laggy uh, effects, compass effects. So go ahead and disable that. I, uh, I do recommend that. I've done that myself. Okay, that's the first thing. Just a little tip. Now the next thing I want to show you is called Show Mouse. And it's right here. I don't know why you would use this on a daily basis. It's just a fun thing to do. But uh, anyway, if I just press Super and then K, you can see right here, I've got a weird cursor. Um, so what I can do is uh, I can set the radius, basically customize all this, so it you know spins around. I can set the rotation speed, so it's fast. It looks weird, I know, but uh, I guess it's just for fun. So, <laughs> okay, let me put this down. And here we go. So uh, if I go to particle options, you have a few options. For example, the color, I can change that to, uh, yeah, let's just make it uh, pink, because I like that, I like being girly. Um, you can uh, change the number of particles, particle size, and basically, if you like this uh, thing right here, then go ahead and play a little bit around with the uh, settings. So that's basically just the um, show mouse. Uh, effect in CCSM. So uh, I'll go ahead and disable this thing right now. So super K. And again, you can customize this uh, to initiate in a different way. Mine is set to super K. The third thing I want to show you guys is um, a thing that you might have seen in a few of my videos. So when I move my window around, as you can see, it's transparent. So the way I do this is in CCSM. I scroll down until I see window management and right here it says move window. I click this and um, right here it says opacity. So I've set that to uh, 80 and you can change that. So uh, I'll try to change it to yeah 39. That's fine. And as you can see the window is almost gone when I drag it around. So I'll set that back to uh, 80. So as you can see it's a pretty nice feature and it looks pretty damn cool. So uh, you can't do very much with uh, this effect other than uh, you can initiate it with uh, your mouse like I do right here when I drag the window and uh, I can click Alt and F7 so I'll just do that and uh, basically I can just drag the window around like this. Okay that's that. So uh, that's the um, transparent window uh, I have in my videos. The last thing I want to show you guys is a default thing in Ubuntu, uh, I believe it was from uh, 11.10 and uh, so on. Uh, it's basically a Windows 7 feature. So when I drag my window to the side, you'll see this thing right here, snapping windows or whatever it's called. As you can see, it works both ways. So if you don't like this feature, then go ahead to uh, Window Management and then go down to Grid. And all you have to do is disable grid and you won't get annoyed with this Windows 7 feature if it annoys you. So um, that's it. Four things in uh, this video. So um, I guess that that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Have a nice day. And remember to uh, comment if uh, you want me to show you more effects in a new video. So um, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Have a nice day. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Let's go.